Hola mis amores, hello everybody. If you are returning and clicking another one of my videos, but if you are new, hello, welcome. Please make sure to subscribe button down below. I would love it if you would join my little family here on YouTube. <laughs> I do post twice a week, but just in case, make sure to turn those notifications on just so that you don't miss any of my videos. Now for today, the reason that you clicked on this video, I will be doing a review on the Tease Suda Warmer Battle Prep Face Primer. Now, guys, this little thing was interesting, honey. Real interesting. <laughs> I gave you guys a little demo and a review toward the end, so make sure to stay tuned for that. But if you would like to see my review on this tease primer, then make sure to keep on watching. Okay, señoras and señores, really wanted to, to try this primer out. Y'all know I'm so big on like trying out different primers, different powders. I love doing that stuff. Let me uh, show you guys the texture so you guys can kind of see what I'm working with here. But this is what it looks like. It honestly kind of smells like a salon, like a salon smell. It claims to make, make the makeup last double hydration and it has shea butter and passion flower boost uh so it's a, a smoothing face primer cream so i think it's like a moisturizer and a primer which is beautiful i love that guys it feels so nice it literally looks like a moisturizer it doesn't even feel like a primer or anything which is crazy to me but this one i am just gonna put all over my face just because it's a hydro primer so i'm just gonna put some there put some there it literally feels like a moisturizer guys it's crazy in mind when i'm rubbing i'm also like pushing in do you see like it did help a little bit with the smoothing here which is beautiful because that's where I have a lot of my pores. I don't see it a lot on my nose, but maybe do I just need to put more? It honestly feels so nice on the skin. Okay, señoras y señores. So, ya terminé toda mi cara. And now I'm back here to talk about this little magical thing. Uh, so again, it is the uh, T Suit of Armor Battle Prep Face Primer, and this is what it looks like right here. Viene con un tambito de primer, guys. Okay, so when I first opened this and I read everything, se mira como un moisturizer, literal moisturizer all the way. It literally looks like you just have to put this on your face and do skincare. <laughs> And supposedly that is what it claims um, because it has a lot of rich ingredients. That's what it says. It has a lot of rich ingredients in the product itself, but it's supposed to be a primer uh, that's supposed to be super moisturizing. It's supposed to be smoothing. Um, and to kind of go over kind of what I felt um, when I put it on, it felt so nice on the skin. It felt really um, hydrating, moisturizing, and I love the fact that um, it made my skin feel really, really nice. And you guys seen, um, there were areas where it looked really, really smoothing. It looked super pretty. The only thing that I will say that I wasn't like too, too happy about was that I did say that it was supposed to be super smoothing now only smooth like this part right here all in all i think it's a good primer feel like i would rather use this on days where i'm not putting any makeup on uh just because again it felt like a really nice moisturizer on the skin and when i first opened it i'm a really big smeller i'm a big like i like i need to know how things smell and when i first smelled it it had like a really strong smell like of a salon smell if you know you know um but that's what it smelled like but when i put it on my face it smelled so nice and just like natural if that makes any sense but um it just smelled fresh so it didn't have like that like it didn't have like that super salon smell after i put it on and like put it on my face it just smelled like salon when it was in the bottle so just in case you're really big on smells, because I am. <laughs> Precious of it, I'm not mad at it. There is just, again, a couple of things that I didn't really like, especially when I'm doing my makeup. Because I feel like when I put my makeup on, I want to look like I have a filter on. <laughs> so this just didn't completely do it for me. It did it in some parts, but not completely. Uh, but yeah. 
so i really hope that you guys enjoyed this video thank you guys so so much for watching please don't forget to like comment subscribe and make sure to turn the notifications on just so that you don't miss any of my videos and i will see you all in the next one bye